Hey, this is Chance from Spider WordPress. In the last video, we set up this nice looking background area with the link and the background color, all using the point and click controls through the website weaver. In this video, we're going to set up the header area and get this looking all nice and pretty. So, over to the website weaver, here's the preview of the scene. So, this time, we're going to be using the header settings. So the first thing that I want to do is change this to uh, a transparent area. I don't want a block color in there, I just want the background area to show through. So I click the no BG color for the header background color and save and that will make this area transparent. Then obviously I'm going to need to change the, the, the colour and the font of the, the text in here so that everybody can see it. So I'm going to expand this text, link, logo and RSS icons settings area. And I'm also going to change the font. So for this, for this theme I like the Dante font or Dante, however you want to say it. Now I'm going to choose Dante, Dante for my site title and for my tagline. And I'm also going to choose a different color because it's pretty difficult to see the dark on the back on the uh, dark background. So again, I'm going to use the colorzilla plugin to pick some colors that are going to work well with the site. So I'm just going to take a sample color here and copy the color code. this color for both of these and save the settings. So none of this is actually showing up on the front end yet. This is all just showing up in the preview area so you get everything looking just how you like it. Then you update the theme and then you'll see it on the front end of the site. So that's much better. And the next thing I want to do is add my logo. So click upload, browse for my logo graphic and upload that. And now I just want to make this a bit bigger so you can see the logo, get it into a, a good position. So about there, get the header height working nicely with the with the logo, about 160, you get a little readout here of how high an area is, and just move this into the right spot. And I also want to put in my own RSS logo there, or RSS icon rather, so browse for the RSS icon that I have ready. Upload that. And move that into the, the spot that I want it to be. Now I also want this text to be a little bigger. So I think around 70 points is a good a good size for this, this font. I'm gonna make this one 50. See how that looks. That's pretty good. I like that. Just click this RSS icon. Get something nice and neat next to the, the header. And I think I'm probably gonna go for a little darker color on the tagline just so it's a little different to the site title. Pick a little bit of a different color here. And then save. Alright, so I'm happy with how that looks, so I can go ahead and update the theme. the end result. 